The latest from our daily newsletter at podnews.net. Think Dynamic Audio Insertion is only good for ads? Well, in April, TED Talks Daily released a mystery episode using PRX Dovetail, the company's dynamic audio insertion tool. The show played a random episode to listeners and they documented the process and what it did in terms of total audiences. It's good news. You'll find it linked from our show notes and our newsletter today. Paradiso Media, a French podcast production company, has received a Series A funding round. Variety suggests the funding was $5.9 million. The company launched a show on Spotify Greenroom yesterday. MailChimp has been bought by Intuit, the owner of TurboTax, for $12 billion. MailChimp has never raised money, been profitable from day one, and famously was the podcast sponsor for Serial's first series. Now ordered by Total Monthly Listeners, the Australian podcast ranker for August has been released. Hamish and Andy remains number one podcast with 900,000 listeners. ARN's iHeart Podcast Network Australia remains number one publisher with 3.4 million listeners or 15% of all Australians. Total downloads increased in August to 49 million. River Radio, a radio station in the UK, is working with podcast company Wooshka to be a podcast-first radio station. The station has around 20 subject-focused hour-long shows. Podspike, a podcast promotions company, has launched a podcast clinic to help podcasters gain more listeners. Podcast Page has integrated with Podchaser and Verbal, the world's largest streaming audio database, has a new look. Brittany Hall, formerly of Sony Music, Pandora and Megaphone, is the new head of sales at podcast analytics and attribution company Chartable. The company has also recently hired Lanji Jambrone and Ray Knopf as account managers. Deborah Parenti has been promoted to president of radio, TV and podcasting at Streamline Publishing. The company publishes Podcast Business Journal, whatever that is. And are there too few black men in podcasting? Cornelius Gould is interviewed by Blueberry. And in podcast news, launched last month, Truth Detective is a new indie podcast from Stephanie Lee, questioning everything about culture, society, people, places, our justice system and corruption in private corporations and government agencies. What do people in advertising do besides ads? A new podcast launches today called Besides Ads. It's about people in advertising who do remarkable things outside of advertising. It's created and hosted by Mark Hartzman. Big Natural Talents is one of four new podcasts to create what DM podcasts claim is more female-focused media. The others include podcasts focusing on sports and relationships. Indisputable with Dr. Rashad Ritchie is a new podcast from TYT. As a result of their partnership with Acast, it launched on Monday and comments on the top news stories about criminal justice, politics, social justice, policy and racism and welcomes a conservative into the bullpen for a fiery debate. And The Fault Line, Dying for a Fight, is a new season of the investigative journalism podcast from Something Else. It examines the still unsolved 2019 homicide of Sean Keelia, a prominent face of the anti-fascist movement in Portland. And that's the latest from our newsletter. For all the links, we're at podnews.net.